I have previous video where I created a system.io inline form, but we want to integrate that inline form inside the WordPress account. So basically all your WordPress website will have the form that is linked to system.io. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can integrate your system.io inline form inside your WordPress account. Now, before I begin, if you are new to this channel, do subscribe to this channel so that you can get more digital marketing tips for your business. Without further ado, let's jump into my computer. Let me show you how you can integrate your system.io inline form inside your WordPress website. Let's go. Let's just open up your WordPress account, WordPress page. As you can see, this is a WordPress page. I wanted the form to be right on top. I've already created an inline form. You can watch in the previous video. I do not want to mesh them together because there are two different things, right? For example, this is the inline form that I want. I want the form to be in between my content. So it's very easy. I created a sales funnel for it. I created an inline form based on my previous video. All you have to do is just get the script. Control C, copy link to clipboard. Go to your WordPress dashboard, go to the page or page. So I'm doing on sample page, click on it. So it looks like this. For now, I don't have any forms yet, right? So where do I put the form? Click on the plus sign, search for HTML, custom HTML. Click on it, drag. Now this is similar for any builder that you use, whether it's Elementor, DV Builder or Block C or whatsoever, right? All you have to do is just find the HTML block, then put it in, copy the whole thing in. And click on preview you look like this then click save you can see there's this batch icon the batch is here is because i'm using a free version so that's the reason why let's just uh, refresh and you can see the form here so it is that easy what happens if you edit the form does it change here as well let's have a look so let's just go here edit page this is the form my email by the grade can hang up okay okay let's just click save changes and then when you go to here, you click on refresh, you can see that it has changed accordingly. So you can edit accordingly. So right, yeah, it is that easy. So again, same thing. All you have to do is just get the code from system.io. You go to any builder in WordPress, just put in the HTML element inside, put in the code and you're done. You just have to edit accordingly to how it fits your page. Okay, if you like what I share, give me a like, subscribe to this channel. This is a quick video and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.